because gold dust never makes anything taste better. It's a total gimmick. What up, yeah nahs? It's yeah nah time. Yeah nah means no and nah yeah means yes. Money is no object and no gifting anything you nah yeah to are the only rules. Our host Herwin is away visiting his family in Melbourne, but I am your fill-in host Noel Dong chatting in here from Portland, Oregon, and I'm joined with my co-host in hype, Johan Carrasco in Melbourne, Australia. And how's a, it? How's it? And a very special guest, Mariah, aka Justice for 1010 on Twitch. Welcome in, Juzzy. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Let's kick it, guys. This one gets a nah yeah from me. I feel like I support Ooh. anyone with the like audacity and confidence to wear any any part of this collection. I certainly cannot. So maybe it's like a uh, nah yeah for everyone else and a uh, yeah nah for me personally, Justice for Ten Ten. But loving the uh, the confidence of the collection, I think. I would say uh, the watch is like pretty outrageous, um, but I'm also a fan of, I don't even know what you call this. It's like a onesie pull up zip dress situation. Um, maybe it's like the, the gaze the model is giving me, like daring me to say anything negative. It's maybe I think the gaze of the model, um, again, daring me to say something bad about it. Um, I have nothing bad to say about it. I love it. I do. <laughs> or at least I love her. Uh, just like Juzzy, the model, but the different model is the, the one with the brown sweater. It makes me really want that sweater. <laughs> I actually like it because there's no Gucci written on it. I don't even know what Doraemon is, but it looks pretty cool. But yeah, I really vibe the sweater. I really like that. I wouldn't mind that. Oh, like the hoodie, sorry. I wouldn't mind the, the cream sweater, but the Gucci's putting me up. The fact that it says Gucci, yeah. Yeah, because it's a bit too like, hey, look at me. Other than that, I really like that brown hoodie. It's probably the only thing I'd, I'd like in this collection. <laughs> nah, yeah, for me, just for that. Actually, in general, like, I've been very opinionated about it. Like, I'm always <laughs> funny about, like, high-end stuff. Because I was looking through these and I'm like, the prices are insanely high. <laughs> like, it, I know it's no, money's no object in this uh, game, but it's just so, I mean, it's just a t-shirt. <laughs> like, why does it cost, like, nearly a $1,000? <laughs> like, it doesn't make sense. Having said that, though, I didn't really watch Doraemon growing up, but I do like, I think his character is really cool. I am a big fan of pouches, like kangaroos, etc. You can put your snacks in there and stuff. And here, and this guy has, like, his own snack pouch. <laughs> like, <laughs> and on top of that, too, like, in general, like, I mean, every year, there's always a whole bunch of Lunar New Year stuff. Um, I celebrate Lunar New Year. It tends to be like a really big cash grab sort of thing uh, towards the Chinese market, but and this is no different. Having said that though, I do also like this hoodie. It is it is less overt with the Gucci branding. It's just showing the Ox uh, Doraemon, which I think is really cute. And he still has got that trademark pouch. And also if there's, I was asked to get anything else, probably that same cream colored sweater and maybe the white t-shirt i just noticed as well. the guy with the tote bag i wouldn't <laughs> mind that tote bag either but the the shoes bag? are they doraemon shoes if those shoes are a part <laughs> of the collection i like that too i mean sure yeah. Let's say yes. <laughs> Probably just the t-shirts and the sweater and the hoodie for me. We're not all cool like uh, Juzzy and can pull that off. <laughs> so, oh, uh, I, I'm very upfront. I cannot pull that off. I do like it on its own and on that model. I think she's the only person in a world of 7 billion people who can pull off this look. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe she gets the, the nah yeah from me oh, and everything well, else again. <laughs> you know me with Uber Eats. I'm like the number one customer. <laughs> so this is a, a nah yeah. Why not? It's a chicken burger, man. Or what do you guys call it? Chicken sandwich? Chicken burger. <laughs> it's, a, it's the same thing. I <laughs> know. Oh, yeah, this is a nah, yeah, man. Who doesn't like Amex chicken <laughs> burgers chicken and, <laughs> and Uber Eats? And yeah. it's gold too. Yeah, yeah the gold does. You yeah. feel rich as you're eating. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so actually, I may say the almost exact opposite. I am so oh. sorry. Whoa, <laughs> we're gonna come to blows right here, right now. We're not even yeah. done with this. Um, this actually gets a huge yeah nah for me. Ooh. Cause anything, cause gold dust never makes anything taste better. It's just like an adornment. It's just a garnish. And it's like a reason to upcharge you by like, I don't know, 50%. It's a total gimmick. I do love the printed, I'm yours, be mine, XOXO <laughs> stuff. That that to me is, is perfection. That gets it. And uh, now, nah, yeah, but the gold dust on the chicken? No way. Okay. I want to know exactly how much gold is on this chicken and how much I'm being <laughs> how many upcharged carrots? for it. <laughs> how many carrots of gold? <laughs> mm -hmm, exactly. Well, for me, like, I, I actually don't know how much it, like, because uh, it says 15 bucks. So I don't, like, it sounds like a sort of New York price for, a, like, a chicken burger. But, like, for me, I'm not, uh, yeah, but more in terms of, like, I'll just eat it because it's a fried chicken mm. burger. <laughs> 
I don't know what happens to the gold when it passes through your system. Does it <laughs> does it look gold at the other end? <laughs> does that gold mean? nuggets? Yeah, you get, yeah, gold, yeah nuggets. gold nuggets. Hell yeah! I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna eat gold nuggets and make gold nuggets. Honestly, overall though, I don't like Valentine's Day that much. There is a lot of like fluff that comes with it. Every time you go out and you go eat, mm. like I eat with my partner, they always have like special Valentine's menus. And I'm like, just serve your normal menu, damn it. I don't want some <laughs> stupid menu. Well, have it every day, have it every day, right? Yeah, yeah. I just, oh, yeah, yeah, just, yeah. I just have this regular. I just have whatever you normally have on your menu at the the, the fancy restaurant we decide to go to. And also, they upcharge everything, like flowers and all that. It's a big, like, commercialized gimmick thing. Obviously, this is a similar uh, sort of thing, though, um, because Amex is Amex Gold is working out uh, with them. I, I want I, that, <laughs> but I want that. I, I never tried Fuku by David Chang. Apparently, they tried to open one here in Portland, um, and people oh. like pooped on it really hard and then he closed it Ooh. oh really i've had it once before it wasn't i mean i don't think it was anything any better than any other chicken sandwich i've had yeah because uh, i heard that price range yeah i heard it's not so. as good not good for the price you're paying but i do want to try it despite that and also i really like david chang in general like i like his ugly delicious mm -hmm. show and i like how he looks like he's drunk all the time but he's not so or i like is he? i'm or, or is he yeah i still i still would get this despite all the shit i just said so i was actually trying to find the price and I could not find anything, so it's good to know that that hasn't been released yet. I say that the main colorway gets a nah yeah from me, and the mm -hmm. other two I'm a little bit on the fence about. They may kind of lean towards the yeah nah, but I love the function of it. I think it's super cool, and it's kind of what I already do with all my shoes anyway, so the fact that uh, Nike's coming out with something that can conform to how I already take off my shoes is is pretty nice so this gets a nah yeah yeah just like uh jazzy <laughs> i like the the white colorway i like just the whole like even what the model in this video with the matching socks and pants <laughs> <Jip>. I, <laughs> I like that yeah the jip <laughs> i really like that um that combo <laughs> that's a nah yeah but yeah also those other two colorways just look plain to me it doesn't they look orthopedic the, it does doesn't it I didn't know the word, what word to use. Nurse style. Yeah, pretty much. Absolutely. Yeah, nurse shoes. Nurse chic. <laughs> but it also, the only thing that concerns me is the durability of the shoe. It just feels like, no, that elastic looks like elastic anyway. Does it have a chance of like, sort of like wearing? They, they did you know a thing. I, mean? I was watching, well, I was watching yeah. the, I mean, don't get me wrong. When you watch like uh, videos where they show how they manufacture something, they tend to hide stuff yeah. because it's obviously yeah. by the company. They're not going to show you something breaking. Yeah. They did show how it's like a kind of like an elastic band around the side. And when, mm -hmm. when they made yeah. the prototypes, it was basically like a band they like they stitched to the outside. And they showed this thing where they were living in Ikea when they constantly have that thing that punches the chair to show you how strong it is, how durable yeah. it is. They had a thing and it just kept bending the shoe. So they probably could test how many times before it, the elastic gave up. So that's what I saw anyway. But yeah, I mean, it's it's the first concept, right? As in the first one of its kind. So I'll be a bit iffy about it, just getting like the first iteration of it. Uh, but I do like the concept though. Like um, it's just a lot easier. And like Juzzy, like I do do that to many of my shoes anyway. So <laughs> yeah, this is a nah yeah. For me, nah yeah as well. There's so many practical applications for this. My brother-in-law has issues with putting stuff on uh, because of his condition. It's definitely something we thought of for him. Also. There's nothing wrong with everyone else getting it too. So, especially in this day and age, we're constantly at home. I, like, I'm just thinking about it for me with like, I just want to go, I have my hands full and I got to let George out too, my dog. Oh, I just put my feet in like that. I don't need to use my hands at all. It's awesome. I, I, I do do it too, like with you guys. I take my shoes off and put them on like that. Uh, but, this, but this is actually designed so you don't wreck the back mm. part of the shoe, which constantly gets destroyed for me. And I like my shoes to last a little longer, especially if they're like, something that they don't drop as frequently to replace. So, so yeah, no, um, so not yet for me, only in that white volteal yeah. sort of colorway too. The other ones, I agree with you, they do look really plain. Uh, it kind of sucks for nurses or, or whatever. Like <laughs> like if they if they wear like fire Wait, kicks, they, they're constantly gonna, <laughs> yeah. you're constantly gonna assume they wear the worst looking shoes. <laughs> they look so plain, like the black, blue, red, it's just like hints of color. Yeah. It's really boring. I'm sure if these um, do well, which I hope they do because I want them to make more of these sort of thing, make more iterations, that they come up with better colorways as well. <laughs> like an infrared style, like an Air Max 90 infrared, or like I reckon like a grayish thing with pops of color on it would be nice. Thanks for joining us on Yeah Nah, fellow Yeah Nahs. Uh, if you enjoyed our videos, please like, comment, and subscribe, and be sure to check, click the little bell icon on YouTube to get notified of new episodes. You can also check out our podcast, Yana Claimed, also on YouTube and wherever all great podcasts are found. Thanks 
Thanks for joining us, Mariah. You can check her out and her 3070 at twitch.tv <laughs> slash justice for 1010. She's great. She also has a very calming voice, if you didn't notice, and that's great to listen to. Till next, a year now nah for those who celebrate it. We at Quartzite Theory wish you a very happy and prosperous Lunar New Year, and I guess Valentine's Day if you celebrate it. <laughs> Peace. Peace.